welcome and welcome to the Asna present how we're doing this beautiful sunday morning the day after a very great sorry i was saying great a very convincing win against wolves 2-0 kai have scoring saka scoring Kayava to having one goal and assist, Saka having one goal and assist, yet the agenda in case Kai Havertz has not ceased. What do you want from this guy? Is the donkey, is a giraffe, but he keeps delivering. What do you want from him? You don't rate him yet, he's on your lips every time. You don't rate him yet, he's on your lips every time. Is a donkey, is a giraffe, is useless. Yes, he's doing more than the strikers left behind at Chelsea. What do you want from this guy? What do you want? Eh? Havas has been showing the workings on the pitch. He didn't start as a striker last season and still scored 14 goals. He says I just started for 2024-2025. He already has one goal and one assist already. And someone has shout, boy, he can score 20 goals. Goes to, you think he can't score 20 goals? Did you notice something about yesterday's game? No, no, ask my fans, let me know. No, 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 let's pause. Let, let, let's do the next for guys. Let's do the next for guys. Like the video. I almost got lost in the source of Kai Havertz. We'll come back to that. Subscribe if you're new here and make sure you turn on Like the video, subscribe if you're new and make sure you turn on your notification bell. Back to what I noticed during yesterday's game. The amount of crosses Martinelli and Saka were playing yes, were actually put into the box yesterday for Kai Havertz. No, not all the not all the all the crosses were successful, but the the one that was successful, you saw that wonderful goal. I think in the 25th minute or 26th minute when Kai Havertz scored it. Brilliant header. That's it. The goalkeeper was was hoping he could reach it, but no, that was a fine placement of a cross from Asaka. And we saw a few crosses from Martinelli that actually missed Kai Havert and Saka. He's not that great with his heading technique, but you saw what has changed because we are going to be playing to the strengths of Kai Havertz and Jesus this season. Whether you like it or not, whether you rate Kai Havertz or not, he is going to be heavily featured in Nasdaq's goals, in Nasdaq's attack this season. Whether I like it or not. Now, when people are saying Kai Havert cannot hit the 20-goal mark, I find it very funny because for you to hit the 20-goal mark, you need availability, right? And Kai Havert is always available. He rarely gets injured. And when he's available, I understand. He misses a few chances here and there, just like the best of strikers in the world. They don't convert all their chances 100%. Now, Kai Havert might miss a bit more, but provided he's available, I can create the right volume of chances. <laughs> so let, let, let's listen to what uh, uh, what was him, Rory Jennings of uh, talks for how to say regarding Kai Havertz uh, when a contributor called and said Kai Havertz was going to score 20 goals and he vehemently had this to say let's take a listen this is called Sky, uh, sorry, talk sport fair use and fair use He said, you heard that, right? He said the contributor must be insane to think that Kai Havas can score 20 goals. Even though he has opened this, this scoring yesterday, so 19, go 19 more goals to go with 37 more games to go. In the English Premier League, the challenge is that can Kai Havas score 20 goals in the English Premier League? And I'm telling you, I'm not missing my words, Kai, ha Kai Havas this season will score more than 20 goals for asthma in the English Premiership. I'm confident about that. I am not only optimistic. I say I am confident between optimism and being confident. I am very, very confident. Barry, no sudden injury because he has a, a fantastic uh, non-injury record. I expect, I expect, regardless of whether you guys trust him or not, even last season, when a lot of Arsenal fans were not trusting him, I, I told you guys, he will come true because I know what I want. Even at Chelsea, I know what I was watching. Chelsea make a lot of players look below their standard, below their quality. Now he has come to a proper team. You're not seeing the real Kai Havertz. I expect 
Kai Havertz has come on at 20 goals this season, and he will deliver. He's going to be playing majority of the role as a striker. For way of saying, as telling the attack how they want to play, Kai Havertz will score a lot of goals. Yes, he missed a chance yesterday with his, on his right foot. We know his right foot is not the strongest, so you can't not overly criticize that. But the headers, the ghost into the box, Kai Havertz is still there. He might not be a cup of tea aesthetically, but Kai Havertz is that guy. He will score a lot of goals for Arsenal this season. He will, just the way he shamed a lot of his naysayers last season and that was this season, he's going to do more. There are still a few Arsenal fans who don't rate him, who are still shouting, we need a striker. Kai Havertz cannot do it. He will put the guys to shame. So it's funny that some Arsenal fans don't rate Kai Havertz, who has shown you the empirical evidence of how to do it, but you rate Ivan Tony because it's English. <laughs> really? Really? Ivan Tony is not even as good as Kai Havertz. He is not. He, he doesn't have the tech. He doesn't fit how we play. He doesn't have the... the, 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 the see... You see, a lot of you have to just come to terms that you are you are, you are stupid, and you have your own biases. Everybody, everybody, every, everybody, he may have their own biases, but you have to make sure you don't allow your biases to consume you mentally and logically. I am not saying Antonio is not a good striker, but he's not as good as Kai Havertz. Kai Havertz gives you the guile, the skill, the technique. If he actually is still all made for how we play, I want just a battering ram that can play for the likes of Brentford. The, in the lower leagues, in the lower teams, rather, the mid-table teams, when it comes to the top team, there's a reason why the top teams are not even venturing into trying to save Antonio. Don't tell me about call, call his betting scandal uh, case he had last time. He's not called the betting. See, if you're good enough, people will make excuses for you. Across all facets of life, if you are that guy, regardless of what you've done in the past, people will make excuses for you. Let me give you an example. Mr. Greenwood. Nice name for Olympic, Olympic Marseille. Make of it what you want to make of it. If you're good enough, regardless of what you've done, people will find a way to make excuse for you. So when it comes to Ivan Tony, he is not that guy. Kai is that guy. Regardless of the agenda being pushed, who is a donkey, he can't score 20 goals. He is going to score more than 20 goals this season. Yeah, let's open his account. And we know he's going to feature heavily. Him and Jesus are going to be actually sharing that number nine spot for Arsenal. And I expect him to score. And I expect Jesus to score nothing less than 15 goals this season. So it should be a fantastic season, regardless of the agenda being pushed against Kai. It's not going to work. He didn't work last season. I don't expect it to work. People are forgetting Kai Havertz is not even in his prime yet. He is still 25. He's not 26, 27, or 28 yet. So is he a developing striker? Either way, you slice it or dice it. So this agenda is peace poor. It, 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 it's not making sense. Especially when the numbers are showing you your agenda is not agendering. So let me know what you think in the comment section of Arsenal fans. Are you expecting Kayava to score 20 goals? Or you are a heavy doubter in this area saying, nah, he's not good enough. He can't score 20 goals. Let me know in the comment section. You are free to disagree with me. But let's make it respectful. Uh, let's make it civil. And let's not break any, any YouTube law. So let's, let, let me know in the comment section what you think. Do you think I have us to break, to score that 20 goals? Or you think he will not score the 20 goals? Let me know in the comment section. You know my, you know my stance already. I am not the, I'm not optimistic. I am confident that Kai Havertz will score more than 20 goals for Arsenal this coming season. I'm not saying he will be the highest goal scorer in the Premier League. I'm just saying I'm sure he will score more than 20 goals for Arsenal. Like the video on your way out. Very, very important. Subscribe if you're new here. And do not forget to turn on your notification bell. Like the video. Subscribe. And do not forget to turn on your notification bell. And I'm waiting for your comments regarding Kai Havas going to goals this Premier League season. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>